From drones to data, technology is the new weapon in the battle for universal health coverage. UHC means providing the care people need without imposing a financial burden. But right now, only half the world's population have access to essential health services. And of those who do, about 100 million are being pushed into poverty just to pay for them. Here are five innovations that could help plug the gaps in global health care. Innovation number one, drones. California-based company Zipline is setting up the world's largest drone network in Ghana. The goal is to deliver urgent medical supplies in minutes instead of hours. 2,000 clinics are signed up to the service, providing emergency care for up to 12 million Ghanaians. Along with its sister project in Rwanda, the network is expected to save tens of thousands of lives over the next few years alone. Innovation two, mobile health. Apps and text messaging services are now helping millions of people manage chronic diseases, screen for cancer, and even quit smoking. The Be Healthy Be Mobile service works in 11 countries. It makes users more aware of risks from non-communicable diseases, which account for 71% of global deaths. One program targeting smokers has more than 2 million users in India alone. 75% of participants said the service was helpful. And in one survey, 19% said they hadn't smoked for at least 30 days. <laughs> Innovation number three, self-testing. HIV self-testing kits are now available in 77 countries. They're part of a global initiative to reach the 8.1 million people who are living with HIV but are unaware they have the infection. A million self-tests were carried out in 2017, and it's hoped that that figure will grow to well over 16 million by the end of 2020, making the goal of ending AIDS by 2030 a real possibility. Innovation four, data management. Estonia has digitized 99% of its health data. Every clinic is connected and health records can be securely accessed by health providers and patients anywhere in the country. That means 99% of prescriptions can be issued digitally, giving GPs more time to see their patients. And ambulance crews have almost instant access to patient histories, saving vital time in an emergency. 1.3 million Estonians are in the national database. And so far, the system has run 11 years without a major security breach. Innovation number five, new healthcare models. Clinicas del Azucar is a private clinic that offers specialized care to some of Mexico's 14 million diabetics. It's looking to plug the gap between the country's private and public healthcare systems by offering a patient-tailored service priced somewhere between the two. Everything from diagnostics to aftercare is run out of the same space. Overall, the system has reduced appointment times by up to 80%, cut patients' annual costs by 75%, and lowered their diabetes complication rates by 60%. Technology alone won't be able to deliver healthcare for everyone. But these innovations, and others like them, have the potential to revolutionize the world's healthcare systems. They could even help shape entirely new ones of their own. <laughs>